line. Oh, this is amazing. going on, lots of yapping and yelping and this is all a very important part of their social structure. These animals are extremely closely knit. They hunt in packs. For instance, when these pups were really small, back in the den, other members of the family would have brought food back for them. They would have hunted, eaten the food, brought it back, regurgitated for the pups. So these guys really are invested in each other. They are a close knit unit. But that means there's lots of reminding and reassessing and rearranging sometimes even of, of hierarchy within the group so uh, constant activity there's a bit of dominance behavior from Jackie's classroom again. Hope you guys can let me know the name of your teacher as well just to say thank you very much for such a cool teacher that's showing you guys such an amazing window into the world, into Africa and into wildlife. More importantly, you guys want to know why have these dogs got such big ears. And I'm sure you can guess the answer to that so that they can hear better. I'm being a bit silly, Little Red Riding Hood is a, is a good story and there's a little bit of a wolf in the wild dogs as well. But that really is the answer, so that they can hear better. They've got incredible hearing and hearing is a very important part of their, well, their everything. There's all this yapping and screeching going on now, yelping is maybe a better sound. But also when they're hunting, they communicate over the whole area when they're running, hunting down the prey. They can, they've got incredibly interesting techniques of herding animals back, running animals in big circles, and that's very important that they can then hear where the other individuals are at any stage during the hunt. Obviously, so you can get to know them from the spots the white and the brown and the black. 